It looks like we need a redneck truck wash. Just a redneck truck wash? Yep. Okay. She needs wash. Back her into the booth. Found on road floating. <laughs> Doing good for two wheel drive. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, it's running. Swamped. He needs weight in the back. Yeah, there you got lots of weight. You're swamped. And now it's running bad. <laughs> That's the third vehicle swamped in there this weekend. Well, at least you're going to wash it. Dave's tractor to the rescue. Got to tie the cable on. Oh, I wouldn't have done that. You, get the, you can't get it job done right by a Ford, call a case. 580B. Hang on. Twist it. Yeah, you got the undercarriage clean now after all that mudding. That's a good thing. A little bit of water in the bearings for lubrication. I hope that uh, bush bar is strong if that's what he's saying. Well, that was a full detail for retail. You got the interior shampoo and the outside wash. You bet. That was awesome. Now to get a good buck for the shampoo. Any water on this side? Uh, she's all drained out. <laughs> you got it pretty clean. You missed a spot anyways. Yeah. You missed a spot right back there. Oh. Hey, we got seaweed under here. Well, now let's see if it can drive away. Wow, dude, I can I do the honors of that? I Give it a little kiss for good luck, Billy. <laughs> okay, see if she fires up. See if she starts up. Crank it. Crank it. Pump it. Yeah! Well, you're not all washed up. Built for top. Cool! <laughs> and it walked away. Dead bodies everywhere. Give her! Oh, now you're gonna have to wash it again! 
Again. Now you gotta wash it again. <laughs> <laughs> Fighting your front tire, he pops tires. Take it for a boot so he leaves it for a bit. Yeah, he's. 